So we got the controller in test mode here. This is the new one for George Street and Regional Hospital Boulevard. Um, I think all the logic statements have been figured out. Uh, any weird situation that can happen, like a phase being skipped or something coming up twice, um, or any sort of weird scenario has been rectified with the logic statements. We got 53 logic statements in the controller. Um, and it's going from basically phases 1, 2, 4, and 6 with the PEDs to phases 1, 2, 4, 6, 7, and 8. PEDs 2, 4, 6, 8. Uh, PED 13, um, which is kind of my ramp that shoots off to the side. It's the currently unsignalized, but it will run and walk most of the time because the only phases that 13 isn't compatible with is phase 8 in the phase one left turn. Um, on phase 15, there's also an overlap, uh, which runs with, it appears dark with phases four and seven. So as soon as they turn yellow, uh, the green comes up right away. And it's a flashing right arrow because it's protected. Um, but because there's, um, you can kind of see with the in and out, there's nothing on phase 15 like our, sorry, channel 15 red, um, but the monitor always sees the red. So when the overlap is dark, it doesn't throw it into a red fail, uh, but if I pull the load pack, it will throw it into a red fail. Um, this would be a good way to solve the issue with the leading through interval, where it's, if it's monitored on a separate load switch, you could have a constant monitor on the red, and then basically, you just turn off dual indication for red and green and red and yellow and you're going to be fine. Um, you can still run it with like green and yellow if you want, but if you have, uh, where I'm still using, I'm only using amber and green for this uh, overlap. Um, I'll kind of show it in the field. I'll show the before and after once it's all kind of said and done. But yeah, there's a lot more going on here uh, than there was before, but it's gonna make the intersection a little safer for drivers, and a lot safer for pedestrians. Um, I've made the phases for the protected lefts longer, but I'm more it's more adaptive with the time of day plan, and I'm able to tighten up that cycle length, so at least it's able to serve all the directions appropriately. Um, and I can run phase four and eight really short during certain times, because I'm most of that time I can just get that overlap going, uh, keep people moving instead of stopping and going. So yeah, we'll keep an eye on, uh, on this and I'll kind of do some updates again next week.